hello hello everyone how are you guys today i'm here with another video something different though i'm i'm having african food it's like american slash african something of that sort so that is what we're having let me get, show you guys what we're having it is from african delight i hope the lighting is okay it looked kind of But yeah, it's called African Delight. They have a restaurant over in Mableton, Georgia. That's where I'm usually hanging out or basically in that area shopping. I'm gonna show you the items I have here. It's um, rice and beans. Ooh, it looks like it smells so good. Some napkins. And while you guys are here, make sure you like the button, subscribe, and also hit the notification bell. All right. This right here, they call, she called it a, a DB, which is basically grilled chicken cut up and or either anything grilled per se, like beef, the chicken, um, and lamb they had, they served there. So, and then I also got American goose goose. So I don't know. I hope I'm saying it right, but that's exactly what she said, basically. She said American Goose Goose. It looks like stuffing to me. This is American Goose Goose. On the camera, it might show it. It might look like rice, but it really isn't rice. And it comes right here with a whole bunch of sauteed onions. Um, Like I said, the grilled chicken. You got some onions over here. That's one dish. And I got one more dish here. I wanted to try. This one has plantains. It has uh, fried plantains. And it has lamb and onions over here. So I am going to fix up my dish. And then I'll be right back. So I am back with my plate. Already made. Um... I don't know if you guys see. It might seem like it's kind of washed out because of the lighting. But, you know, we have um, the ring light now, so. Say cheese. <laughs> so, I have some lamb right here. If you see. It looks like curry goat to me. And I got chicken. They cut up the chicken, so. I want you guys to see the chicken. Chicken. Oh, that thing look good. Sauteed onions, like I told you. Plantains, rice, and the American goose goose. That's what she said, American goose goose. Okay. So, it looks like, like I said, stuffing to me. But you guys... Tell me, it has a whole bunch of vegetables and stuff in it. You see it? Hope you guys see it. Like focus, focus. All right. So you got some green beans, some um, carrots. It has some snow peas and the sauteed onions. I guess as a like a gravy. Not sure. Okay. It's my first time ever trying it too, so excuse me if I said it wrong. <laughs> but it do taste good though. It didn't look so appealing, but it's good. I want to show y'all how it really looks with nothing on there. But just this. See it? It looks like a whole bunch of green. See it? Oh, yes. And this season is so good. Mmm. That's the plantain. Mm. 
Mm-mm. My napkin's gonna fail. I'll pick it up in a minute. It's a little bag, so. And it's rice and beans. I like it though, it's pretty good. Very tasteful. Can't knock it till you try it, folks. So, African food it is. I'm salting onions here. Oh my god. I don't know how they saute them and season them, but that thing is so good. It has a tangy flavor to it. Not too salty. You can't really taste salt. It's just really like a, a dressing. They put like an Italian dressing, a little bit something similar to that. And the flavor is uh, packed with a whole bunch of flavors. It's really good though. A whole bunch of seasonings. Mm. So good, I swear. Mm. Now, how y'all folks been doing? I'm gonna run in my mouth. I hope everybody been good out there, especially with your mental health and everything. Make sure you get your stuff in check, all that good stuff. This is the lamb. The lamb looks like curry goat, like chopped up goat. That's what it basically looks like. Mm. Mm. But it tastes just like goat. Like oxtails and lamb itself has a very distinctive taste to it. Not a bad way, but it's good. So you know mm -hmm. basically what you're eating and then you can taste it good. Them onions are so good. This the chicken. It looks kind of dry to me, so... Yeah, the chicken just looked dry to me. Okay. It looked kind of old too, so just mm -hmm. that's pretty good. And I got some more plantain right here. American Goose Goose is not bad. I think I have this inside my pantry, but haven't really cooked it. Some flavors they have. That's that lamb. Well, what they did with the lamb, they just cut it up. Uh -huh. Pretty decent.
Can't complain. And you could tell they put this on the grill too. It got that barbecue flavor like. I'm like, ooh. Ugh. <laughs> That's pretty good. Cool. Mm. Only thing I don't like about with the lamb is so much bones. You think you about to get a whole piece of meat? It's really gonna be bone. So that's the only part I don't like. But lamb is pretty good. You feel me? So for all the changes and stuff that's supposed to be going on in the kids' room, downstairs in the living room, you guys will see soon see that eventually. Because I was having a hard time finding something to go inside the living room in the area. I want to put my stuff for like my um my diplomas and things of that nature. Probably some knickknacks and stuff like that. I'm going to end up putting up there on the shelf. And then I'm going to put the computer right here on this side. Right there by the Ethernet and all that other good stuff. So, that's what we're going to be doing. Upstairs, I finally got something to put on the floor, like a rug I'm going to end up making. So, I'm going to put it on the floor and then I'm going to fix all the toys up on the back area. Entertainment area is complete. And the two sides are complete. You just got it cleaned up, so... That is going good. And then in my bathroom, I changed it from a plain color and I put like flowers and stuff like that. So now I got flowers. I might show you guys that once I put some stuff, I want some floating things on my wall. So once I put it up, I will show you. That's the pretty much the only thing that I have to put in there. Everything else is like the shower curtain is up. The little um, thing curtain is up. That has flowers. I have a little circle with flowers. It's all what you'll see it though. So I have a couple of things that's going on here at the house. And then I've been working. Oh, excuse me. So at the hospital, it's been extremely a lot of uh, work we've been doing. Uh, a lot of people haven't been wanting to come to work. So they ain't scared of them. They might get infected or sick of some sort. So, Which I don't blame them, so. That's pretty much it what we got going on here. Nothing quite extravagant at all as much. But um fourth of July, I hope you guys celebrate. We um I'm gonna be planning something in Miami and doing something in Miami. So you guys will see a video from that Miami trip again. I'm always having a Miami trip. I might end up doing a Minnesota trip once everything calms down in Minnesota right now. It's a little bit too chaotic. But I do have a couple of things that's going on that I would like to have going. And flowing basically. Ooh. That is so good. Well, I am not going to hold you folks up. I know this video has been straight to the point. Well, the next few videos you guys will get. And this week, you guys will get two videos since I skipped last week. I didn't post any videos, so. Wow. Mm. Expect two videos this week. This video plus another video. Then the next week afterwards. We don't know. You know, we just felt the flow. So, make sure you guys like, subscribe, and also hit the notification bell. I am headed out. I will see you guys later. Bye.